If you knew your potential to feel good, you would ask no one to be different so that you could feel good. You would free yourself of all of that cumbersome impossibility of needing to control the world or control your mate or control your child. You are the only one that creates your reality. So the, the wonderful Esther Hicks, this beautiful channel soul of wisdom, is sharing the secret to harnessing our vibration, to manifest the life that we want, to be able to shift out of our victim vibration, our grievance, our if only, our if only uh, mentality. Are but if onlys. But if only my boss uh, saw my value. But if only my mate uh, uh, was more interested in me. If only my uh, customers bought more of what I'm selling. But if only my housemate was better at cleaning the house. But if only... The world was more fair. We but if only ourselves into a state of negative lower vibration. That is what it's doing is it is amplifying and we we uh, accentuate and grow and latch on to that energy of if only for this, I could have that. We set up this buffer zone between us and the energy we really need to inhabit in order to inhabit the life and live the life we want to live in order to have what we want to have we need to be the person be that energy inhabit that vibration that will allow us to see the opportunities to attract the people into our life our mentors our partners our customers our friends our allies and to believe in ourselves and take the next action. You are the one that creates your reality. You, by your vibration, you create and magnify that energy. You radiate that energy and it gives you momentum. It gives you inspiration. It radiates and people can sense it around you and they want to do business with you. They want to talk with you. They want to get to know you. If their vibration matches your vibration and you want people who match your vibration. If you are being kind and, and positive, caring, creative, and uh, a, a good person out there in the world, you want all those people like that to, to surround you, to be on your team, to be on team you. And you do that by feeling better, by choosing better feelings, by feeding yourself with good music and good food and good nature. And I think that's the beauty of what Esther Hicks is sharing in this, this great quote. 